Hey everyone, welcome back to Extreme Tech. Today I'm going to show you something super cool and incredibly useful. How to enable God Mode in Windows 10. Yeah, you heard it right, God Mode. Sounds epic, huh? Well it kinda is. This hidden feature lets you access all the control panel settings in one place. No more digging through menus just to find what you need, so let's dive right in. First things first. Make sure you're logged into your Windows account with administrative privileges. You need that to unlock God Mode, got it? Awesome. Now let's get to the fun part. 1. Start by right-clicking on your desktop. Hover over New and click on Folder. Easy peasy, right? Now comes the magical part. 1. Rename this new folder with the following code. I'll put it in the description for you too, but here it is. God Mode. EAD 7 BA 478 E 54 465 E 825 C 997 12043 E 01 C. Make sure you get every character right. Once you hit enter, the folder icon will change to something like the control panel. Guess what? You've just created a portal to Windows Ultimate Control Panel. 1. Double click that new icon and boom, you're in God mode. Welcome to the Digital Olympus of your Windows machine. Here, you'll find over 200 settings grouped into categories. Everything from administrative tools to Windows Defender Firewall. It's all here. Alright, let me walk you through some of the coolest features. Need to tweak performance settings or check your system info? It's all right here. No more digging through submenus. Got a new piece of hardware? Access Device Manager directly and keep your drivers up to date. Trust me, this saves a ton of time. Configure your Wi-Fi, VPN, and even troubleshoot network issues, all without having to remember where these settings are buried. Manage user accounts, change passwords, and even set up parental controls, all in one place. But hey, remember, with great power comes great responsibility. Don't start changing settings if you're not sure what they do. You could end up messing things up, so be careful and maybe stick to changes you understand. One more thing before I wrap up. If you want to get rid of God Mode, just delete the folder like any other. It's that simple. And there you have it, folks. You're now a God Mode master. If you found this video helpful, smash that like button. And don't forget to subscribe to Extreme Tech for more awesome tips and tricks. Hit the bell icon so you won't miss out on any future videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.